Welcome to clickmyproject.com Performance evaluation of different segmentation techniques for underwater images The segmentation is the process of separate the desired part of original images from many color transformation processes In this process we have to segment the underwater images by different powerful techniques as follows After segment the all images we propose the the evaluation of performance of the images to defining which segmenting technique is efficient than another technique the segmentation process is useful method to process of dividing the image to into multi pa multiple parts basically the segmentation is used for to identify the objects or other relevant information in the digital images in this processes we have to segment the underwater images by using different techniques from to evaluate the performance of many methods of segmentation from one to another this is the flow chart of our process uh, segmentation at uh, underwater images using different powerful techniques the first step we have to take the input image as the underwater image the underwater image is obtained to different powerful techniques such as edge reduction k means method and threshold calculation finally we have to perform the evaluation of the uh, used segmentation methods uh, in first of all we, we have to take the input underwater image to obtain the pre some, some pre processing techniques this which process helps to prepare the input image as our proposed to work in pre process the input phase to be pre processed such as gray scaled filtered and then enhanced for the feature extraction process then the feature values are extracted from the input image for the segment of multi parts the then then uh, following process we have to see the edge detection segmentation method this is the one of the powerful segmentation method is to uh, based on ranges of the image pixels in this process we use the canny method to use it for during the detecting the edges on the input image in this edge detecting the threshold values get from the sensitivity of the input images in the edge reduction input value automatically evaluate the high values to calculate the edge values of the input two element vector of the input image the next step is powerful loss uh, k means clustering they easily segment the input image in this process the segmenting process is very powerful to removing the masking in the input images uh, to using the mean values efficiently from to obtain the segmented image in the k means clustering technique the pixel variations of the color transformation should be managed perfectly in this process of segmentation the final process of uh, our tech segmentation technique is a threshold calculation this threshold calculation method is powerful to segmentation method to segment the input image efficiently to using the color transformation by applying the color transformation to separate the image to red green and the blue parts of an input image to the segment the image pixel from using the threshold values of from the each pixel of an input image after segment the all parts as rgb of the image finally concatenate the all parts at the single image value the final process of our uh, segmenting process is this performance evaluation this evaluation method to measure the performance of the segmented image using the three concurrent segmentation methods such as uh, edge reduction k means method and also the threshold calculation using psnr calculation to evaluate the performance of the segmented image this is very useful to know those segmentation methods to how works and what is performance ranges occurs on the each methods of our segmentation is caused by absorption scattering which influences the overall performance of underwater imaging system forward scattering generally leads to blur of the image features on the other hand back scattering generally limits the contrast of the images generating this characteristics while that superimposes itself on the image and hides it is the absorption and scattering the effects are not only due to the water itself but also due to the components such as dissolved organic matter the visibility range can be increased with the artificial illumination of light on the object but it produces non uniform of the light on the surface of the object and producing a bright spot in the center of the image with poorly illuminated area surrounding it 
the underwater image processing area has received considerable attention within the last decades, showing important achievements this paper has to the review on the some of the most recent methods that have been specifically developed for the underwater scenarios. These methods are capable of extending the range of underwater image processing, improving image contrast level and resolution quality after the consideration of the basic physics of the light propagation in the water medium. We focus on the different methods available in the previous articles to the situation for which all the them have been firstly developer or highlighter as well as quality assessment methods used to evaluate the performance. This is the MATLAB main window. In that main window we have to select the current folder. That current folder in the select the GUI.main file. Then right click the GUI.main file, click the run button. After clicking the run button we have to receive the first input window of our process. In that input window, we have to select the first the input button. The input button is representation of when we'll receive the input image from the system. We have to select that first input image. Then we have to apply the pre-processing of that input image. This is the noise reduction image and our output image of our pre-processing technique. And then clicking the RGB button. In the after clicking the RGB button, we have to receive the three three display. The three displays represent us now uh, red, green, and blue image of our input process. Then go to the uh, main display. In that main display, we have to see the three powerful techniques of our segmentation technique. The segmentation techniques are uh, such as edge reduction, threshold, and k means. The clicking the edge reduction method, we have to receive the edge reduction image of canny edge detection image. The after clicking the thresholding. This is a representation of input images with thresholding uh, ranges from our input underwater images. And then finally clicking the k-means clustering. This is the third powerful technique of segmentation in our process. Clicking after the k-means clustering, we have to receive the two window of our process. The first window from the uh, hue saturation and intensity image of our input process. And then we have to the second window in the different cluster levels of our input, uh, input images the uh, four object in cluster 1, cluster 2, cluster 3 and cluster 4 images we have to receive from the after the climbing clustering the final image is a labeled image cluster index that and then finally we have to the evaluate the performance of three segmentation technique clicking the performance button we have to receive the uh, MSC value mean square error, error rate value and the PSNR values for our each segmentation techniques of our input image then of then finally we have to the graph simulation result for input image as a segmentation process from the uh, different powerful techniques of thank you